Hey guys and welcome back to Factorio AB Plus with Arumba. How's it going, man? It's going well. How you doing? I'm doing all right. I'm trying to, I'm trying to work out Hell Mod. Trying. So we can either make synthesis hydrofluoric acid, which is fluoric fluorite ore and sulfuric acid, or hydrofluoric acid, which is hydrofluoric acid and hydrofluoric acid. Yeah, some of the recipes that are in there are pointless and useless, and the reason that they're in there is because of freaking Angel's converter pumps. So through the two-way and three-way splitters that are useless and have never been used ever, um, yeah. Ah, uh, okay. They mess with Hellmod and add stuff that doesn't really belong in there. So, fluorite or sulfuric acid, or catalytic, catalytic cracking acid gas. That's one of the things that I do plan on doing. We've got quite a bit of acid gas available. Okay, I want to have a look at the... Yep. The fluorite or synthesis thing. So sulfuric acid we've got. So how the fuck do we get fluorite or Crystallizing uranium and fluorite. Or making powdered tungsten will give us fluorite ore, but we need tungsten hexafluorite gas, which also requires fluorite ore to make. Okay. So I need mineral sludge, 50 mineral sludge crystallized gives me some fluorite ore. Okay. Where's your, where's your mineral sludge? Let's start with that. I want to focus on just getting at least blue science covered, which is only... Oh, yeah, no, I'm get, I'm, I'm, I'm get, uh, anyway. it, it's not much. We only need uh, two and a half plastic per second to support blue science with our, with a whole setup. So to do that, we can do it off just a tiny, tiny bit. One of these crystallizers on each recipe. Okay. Where'd you go? Is it up there? No way. Yeah. The mineral, mineral sludge is way the hell up there? Holy crap. Oh, well, this is where the slag is. I had assumed you were going to do the mineral fluidy type stuff near the fluids, but okay. I mean, I could have. I think it's but a lot easier just... to route the slag down there. I mean, there's a lot of slag. It's still easier to route it down there than it is to pump pump the sulfuric acid all the way up here, isn't it? Oh, it's one thing. Well, that's a lot of freaking slag. Uh, but barely any of it's converted into mineral sludge. Or not mineral sludge. Yeah. Really, yeah, I've got slag slurry there. Um, so. You need to filter it now. You, you've missed a step. Because I need mineral sludge. Yeah, slag slurry is the intermediate. You need to, to do either do coal filtering or uh, ceramic filtering, which is with aluminum. So we do have aluminum. Let's make some ceramic filters. Filter out all this slag slurry into mineral sludge, and then use the mineral sludge to crystallize. So, okay, so um, ceramic filters are alumina the, and filter the, frames. Yeah, the precursor to the aluminum plate. Wherever you made aluminum plate. Where you get uh, the aluminum plate. The alumina gets used. To make aluminum plate. Like yeah. One to one ratio, yeah. So that was... There's your aluminum coming down. That's right here. Oh, you actually did the aluminum directly uh, casted. I haven't messed yeah. with metallurgy much. That's awesome. I guess we just, like, hork up some of this... <laughs> we don't need That's much. Actually, just the... The, the whole oh, point. We don't. No, the whole point of the ceramic filters is that they are reusable. The the we're actually oh, skipping, shit, son. skipping a step here. Normally, you would use a coal filter, where every single time you do the craft, you have to use a unit of coal. But now that we have the alumina, we'll make. Uh, I I took away the thing so that you can get more. Right, I'm crafting 42 ceramic filters right now. Is that a lot or? It's, it's decent. Um, like for example, if we were using. Is done in the crystallizer? No, it's done in a... There's some more one. alumina. It's, a, it's called a filtration unit. Give me some more alumina. I want to skip filtration unit mark 1s, go to mark 2s. Got to grab some electronic circuit boards real quick. I like how you bypass that rubite. You know, because you never know when we're going to need to mine that out. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid rubite. I'll never know. Yeah, probably not necessary, but... Pfft. 
I don't even think that's the, the top tier of aluminium processing. Um, no, you can mix aluminium with other stuff as well. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot of different aluminium things that you can do. I think this is new though, because I don't remember seeing this. Maybe I'm wrong. No, we yeah, you can mix it with silicon and copper to get three times the amount. And yeah, there's a lot of things you can do with aluminium to get a lot more. And we know that Angel loves to add stuff in the middle of our campaign. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, so we have some filters. Uh, maybe we have. I can make another 48 with the Illumina you gave me. I, I think it's going to be more than enough. You'll see here. If we throw down the filtration unit Mark II. Ah, oh, so far. We need power legs or a train. Personal train. Oh, there's a train. There's a train there. <laughs> By the way, I don't think the train works anymore because one of the mod startup options that I have enabled is to disable loaders into train wagons because apparently they're bad still. So oh, the, okay. I'm pretty sure the train's just been like hanging out over there like, how come I can't get my load? <laughs> oh, no. No, never mind. The wagon over here oh, doesn't uh, doesn't do that. We just mined it out. I missed oh, yeah. a few, few patches, but whatever. Oh, GG. All right, you take half of those. So basically, uh, this guy is going to do slurry ceramic filtering using a ceramic filter slash slurry purified water. Super easy. Uh, out of that guy, we're going to get... Uh, so filter goes in. Filter comes out. And then in a assembling machine, we're going to do the ceramic filter from spend. And it really should say spent ceramic filter. But So you take the spent ceramic filter and then you clean it with purified water. And then you just oh, that's cool. Put it right back in the machine. So this um, guy, well, uh, I mean, we could calculate like how many of these ceramic filters we actually need to support the machine. This guy's going to use it once every two seconds with a crafting speed of 2.25. So he's going to use it 1.125 times per second. Or sorry, he's going to use 1.125 ceramic filters per second. Where this guy can purify or clean one every 0.5 seconds. And of course we would not be using that tier of assembly machine. You know what, this would just be easier in Hellmod. Hellmod is super useful for this kind of stuff. Oh, I see you've you've taken to doing what I do now, and you delete your lines. Your line is now line three. It was two a second ago. Oh yeah. I deleted it to make the the new one. So if we're gonna do, uh, it's slurry, right, or mineral, mineral sludge. Yeah, I've got slag slurry just now. Oh, would you look at that? We're going to end up with more fucking bullshit. Fucking, what's it called? Sulfuric acid crap. And yes, it is still uh, it's still lagging. And giving me like server not responding. <laughs> that is seeming to happen then when I type in the filter, because I did just type in the filter now. See? It happens when I type in the filter as well. So it's not just you. But yeah, when you when you filter stuff, it filters stuff for me. So if I'm on add recipe, you type in a filter, my shit gets filtered as well. It's really annoying. <laughs> oh, let's wait nine hours on I remember doing something that you could easily have done in two seconds with a calculator. Not really. Why? These things take time, Stejo. Filtration unit. Oh, we can only make up to Mark twos. Is that all they go to? Yeah. Oh, that's a box. Uh, well, the ratio is pretty damn close to two to one. So one assembly machine per two filtration unit Mark twos. One assembly machine three can handle about two. Oh, for the, the ceramic filters, you mean? Yeah, to cycle the filter. So where do you want to do this? I mean, I just want to turn all that slag slurry into usable mineral oil. Mineral, mineral sludge. Yeah, well, just... I would uh, do it on the end of this, but leave a little space. 
so that if we need to, we can route it a different way and have pumps and stuff if we want to use the other type of sludge. So like over there? Well, slurry doesn't get used for anything else. It's just it's, a, it's an intermediate. You have to process it. It's kind of like... Oh, do you? Oh, well, just do, it. just do it here then. If anything, you don't even really want to store slag slurry. You want to, You just want to... Oh, know. I was just storing it to get rid of the uh, sulfuric acid, that was all. Okay. Uh, if you notice, I've got it um, wired up now so that these things don't make any more until the storage is empty. What are you doing? I don't know, you said you wanted to build it here, so I was copying the size because we're going to have that much into this much. Aren't we? Oh, that... Well, excuse me? It's, it's going to make... Is one that a one one? one? Yeah, it's one one. You got... Well, how much do you have? You got a ridiculous amount over there. You got 750,000 slag slurry. Oh, it uses 25 slag slurry to make 25 mineral... Oh, shit, my bad. Sorry. It's cool. I'll just duplicate my work. <laughs> That's fine. There you go. Just do it over and over again. It's fine. Yeah, well, how how many filtration units do we need to... Filtration units. I set up a thing in Helmut. I mean, you can tinker with it. You have admin privileges, so... Uh, just, just for the sake of looking at it, it's... um. If we do one setup of 10 factories, I was doing 10 factories to figure it out. If we do two, that'll make 56 mineral sludge per second. Well, we've so. got, we've got six, uh, we've got 12 liquefier mark threes. So how many filtration units are you going to need for 12 liquefier mark threes? So if we, use, if we just used two filtration units right now, we could process this in... 223 minutes. It doesn't take much. I I don't know. Maybe four? So, four filtration unit mark twos doing this purification on slag slurry would be decent. I don't want to make it huge, do you? So, well, just as fast as we can because I want to, I want to have enough shit for if it's going full pelt so that all the slag can get sorted as well. Well, again, make a lot uh, of slag. <laughs> again, looking at the actual like need, this this just having okay. Let's just say we had four crystallized or four filtration units doing the purification. That's 112 mineral sludge per second. If I go back to the production line and look at the science tech tree. Uh, we need six. Oh, so we're gonna have a lot. Six per second to generate the but full bore gonna... blue science thing that you wanted, and uh, this is gonna generate 112. That's just well, like 20 times as much. We're currently making 600 slag slurry a second. <laughs> okay, all right. Well, hey, let's go big, right? You want to process 600 slag slurry per second? Well, yes. see how many damn machines we need then. Uh, we can just do, instead of doing computing by factory, we'll just say we want to process 600 per second. Done. We need 21.4 filtration unit mark twos. Oh, so 22. All right. Easy. I'm, I'm, uh, what? I'm, argh, stupid things. Unfortunately, that no. does mess the ratio up a little bit now. We could actually do just 10 assembly machines filtering, but I I, I kind of like the idea of just having an assembly machine paired with each two units to filter that, you know, in any yeah. like a enclosed system. Because you can't. No, that, sounds, into... that sounds pretty cool. So why don't we, like, spread them out a little bit? Ah, freak, you can't freaking. Yeah, <laughs> you can't pick shift or dolly them. them. Oh, You're so used to it now. I am. Uh, so, all right. All right, I'm pocket crafting like twelve filtration unit mark twos. How many do you have? Uh, two. All right. I, think. I was thinking yeah. maybe like something like this with them in the middle, and we could use ninety degree angle inserters. Wait. Ah, you give it a you give it a thingy, a, a fluid box, and I couldn't shift it. Oh, that's funny. It's also the wrong type of assembly machine anyway. Yeah. If we yeah, line it up exactly. here, then the water yep. is actually close. And what if we alt R this guy? Get the water on there. Oh, okay. So it's like that. Yeah, and the water's nice and close. Uh, we've got purified water coming up here, by the way. Hey, by the way, you made these. So here's your two steel pipe to underground pipe. You hold on to those. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, those can hang out in your inventory forever now. Hey, by the way, yeah. Guess, guess what you get as a byproduct from all this? Sulfuric wastewater. <laughs> yeah, that can or just be. Sulfur. Just do the exact same thing. I'll wire it all up and give it an overflow. And if it's eighty percent or higher, then it'll just get clarified into fuck all.
I like how that was one thing that we were like, oh my god, we need sulfuric wastewater to do X, and then now it's... Yeah, no, it's not. Not a problem. Not at all. Not a issue. Alright, and then what if we take this guy, and why don't we just, like, rotate him, and then we can have... We can actually do this guy out by one. Do you want to have them all in one line on one side or kind of oil, oils, vanilla oil processing style or what? Um, I would. We just decided we want 22 of them. That's yeah, weird, I would rotate It's a weird them. number to build. Why don't we just do 24? We, at least it's going to be. Yeah, just do 24. I would rotate them that way. Yeah, okay, that was, that's good. Okay. And then do that. You mirror it? Yep. Beautiful. Okay, but you forgot the inserters to actually... Like, the blueprint's not ready yet. Yeah, well, I was just... I was just showing you what I would do. Well, you could have rotated it with ghost images and told me to not have the damn nano construction bots be working. Hmm? Okay. I I waste nano nanobots. What I do? I can tell. It, I, it annoys people. So the Just seeing if I like the way the insert arrows lined up better this way or that way. Yeah, they look fine like that. So that takes care of these, this thing here. And uh, each machine then is going to consume one slurry. Okay, so that's one. the inserters for that. I think we just need to prime them with like, I don't know, four or five, just four or five ceramic filters. And I, we, we went over there, we got a little tiny bit of Lumina, and now we have 90. So we have tons. There's 45 of them in case you need them. Thank you. I think right, so is that is that what it's going to look like then? Uh, I think so. Okay. Because it requires something funky, I'm going to do. I'm going to as part of the blueprint. I'm going to put. No, that doesn't make sense because you can't you can't like put entities into the blueprint. How amazing would that be, Steve Joe? What if you oh could have a God. blueprint with a chest, and in the chest you had like four alumina, whatever, and that would be part of the blueprint. It would automatically put that much into the chest when you plant the blueprint. That'd be cool. But and you we'll, could also just choose even distribution. True, but we, the thing is, if you put too many in, then the the whole thing shuts down. It's um, a closed loop. You have to be able to put the bad, the byproduct uh, filter back in. in. Yeah. So you have to put a very small number in. Okay. This is sans light, so you can put the light in and put your purples. Okay, and so we can hook that there. Oh, you didn't do the light. Damn. That's that's quite pretty, Steve Joe. Yeah, looks good. Shit, man, I'm gonna I'm gonna blueprint that whole freaking thing. It looks awesome. <laughs> I'm gonna call this the Stelio Pretty. <laughs> Stelio Pretty Girl. Yeah, I don't know why I'm calling you Stelio, but that's your name today. So, all right, so we need to do that. That's four, and we wanted to do 22, which we're gonna upgrade to 24 just for whatever reason. Which becomes uh, um, six you'll want more, to have... five more blocks like this. Then. Wait a second. You'll also want to have some iron pipe to ground here. And where's your your feedback for the? Uh... Sulfuric wastewater. Or do we want to process this sulfuric wastewater on site? Uh, I do have a feedback that runs all the way from the south. If it's lagging again, it's me. Yeah. I assumed. God, I need to make a fuck ton of iron pipe to ground now. Typical. 
Where do you find the damn recipe to purify sulfuric wastewater? What's it called again? Why is it not showing up? Well, the one that makes it into... <laughs> I just searched for sulfuric wastewater purification. I could, I swear to God it wasn't in there. Maybe yeah, I'm crazy. Wow. Whoa. This setup that you have just insisted on making requires uh, 18 Hydroplant Mark IIs to process this much sulfuric wastewater. <laughs> that's, that's a lot. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's not right. This is asking for more sulfuric wastewater. What have you done, game? Oh, I think I know what it's doing. It's doing that thing where... It's setting the quantity of sulfur. I don't want sulfur. I want to set it by the sulfuric wastewater. Actually, it looks like we need three. Three Hydroplant Mark IIs could purify the, the vast majority of the sulfuric wastewater from this 20... 22... Should we just upgrade it to 22 in Helmon? So that's actually accurate? I think so. I sorry, sorry, to 24. Oh, shit. I need more sulfuric. Ah, I need to connect up the sulfuric wastewater to a output pipe now. In your way? No. Nope. So you're purified water. You're looking to feed back the sulfuric wastewater? Yep. Wait. The sulfuric acid. You know, hold on. Is this whole system going to be closed loop? Could the sulfuric wastewater be purified up here and then used to make the slag instead of bringing the sulfuric wastewater up and sulfuric acid up in the first place? Well, I'm sure you could add it back in. It can't possibly be a system where you get more out than you put in, right? I doubt it. Well, you'll be able to see what the the products are and what the requirements are. We should end the episode there. Do I have to? Because we, yeah, we've gone over. All right. Okay. I guess we're gonna take a break here. We'll be back next time. Bye bye. In a bit.